Stephen Slammon was the only candidate left standing in the initial search process for a fire chief after the other final candidate, current Framingham Chief Gary Darty, dropped his candidacy just prior to a selectman meeting in December. Selectmen initially decided to reopen the search process while appointing Stephen Slammon as interim chief. Many residents expressed disagreement with the decision to reopen the search process during the public forum at the following meeting in January. Selectmen readdressed the fire chief position at the January 5th meeting and decided to appoint Stephen Slammon as fire chief until the final final day in March and in the meantime decide if the search process should be reopened. At the April 5th meeting, selectmen complimented and expressed satisfaction with Stephen Slammon and officially appointed him Hopkinton chief on a permanent basis. I asked Chief Stephen Slammon his thoughts about the process. I kind of was familiar with just what's happening in other organizations and you know I knew that they have to look hard that the fire chief spot, spot is the top spot. And uh, I knew they needed to make sure they, they had the right person in the top spot. So for me, um, I knew I had to do my work, uh, bring my A game, and um, my perspective saw that there were some circumstances outside of their control and outside of my control. So, you know, it wasn't such a struggle for me. I, I had to focus on the job, and uh, I kind of understood uh, where they were. Um, I'm proud. Uh, the community, the way the community um, reacted, that really helps me with my confidence and having that support behind me. So um, uh, I'm happy for the ending. Uh, can you talk about your transition into the role and some of the differences with uh, what you had to do uh, compared to when you were deputy chief? Well, that's a good question. Um, I worked under Chief Clark and uh, I worked as deputy for him for seven years and he allowed me to be involved in most of the operations of the fire department so I've been lucky that that uh, deputy chief slot was like the transition into chief. Um, we've, we're working on marathon right now and he allowed me to be involved in that. Uh, the budgets, some of the uh, apparatus uh, committee for replacement so it's kind of been uh, my whole career it's kind of been a development process and uh, many thanks to him for allowing that. It's been pretty busy since you've taken over as a fire chief. There's been a few fires and a lot of things going on. Sure. Has it made it a little harder to transition into the role with how busy it's been? Uh, I would say it's uh, helped, if anything. Um, there's no sitting back and wondering about anything we're doing right now. It's uh, We've been straightforward in all our projects. The emergency call volume has um, increased as we've Usually we tend to have even some little uh, quiet times, maybe during the spring, but uh, not this year at all, and not last year either. So I think this is kind of the new normal for Hopkinton. We're a growing community. There's a lot of demand on us, and uh, I bet you we're on our uh, 10, 11th, 12th call today. It's been a crazy day. Wow, and uh, speaking of being busy, the Boston Marathon coming up, uh, could you talk about the fire department's role in getting ready for the Boston Marathon? Sure. Um, it, it literally is almost a year-round event for us. Um, we'll run the marathon this year and uh, after the marathon we'll have some post-marathon meetings where we uh, review how things went. Um, literally during the summer we start scheduling next year's process. When we're going to meet again it's fully ramped up by September. So there's really not much downtime. Uh, the downtime gives us a chance internally just to kind of review how we went, make any uh, corrections towards the future and uh, and then start meeting with all the uh, outside people that we work with. So is there a lot of meetings this week in uh, planning everything? Yeah, today we ran the uh, exercise where we work through MEMA. MEMA does a little uh, uh, tabletop type of scenario for all of the public safety officials from Hopkinton into Boston and uh, we do um, live demonstrations of scenarios we might run into. It gives us a chance to test our systems kind of make sure we have resources for all the type of anticipated problems we went into and uh, test our uh, emergency operations center to make sure it's flowing good and, and it went well today um, we had that and we were running the operations of the town at the same time so everybody was all hands today and they did well all right well congratulations once again and we look forward to seeing you around hey thank you very much appreciate the time